All right, let's go ahead in three, two, one. Oh my gosh, guys, it is an Egyptian mummy. This thing is absolutely huge. Look at its red eyes. <laughs> Hey, what's up guys? EY Stream back here with another Minecraft video and today guys, we are going to be spawning in some ancient mummies and Egyptians from the ancient e Egyptian period, I guess? The, the ancient Egyptian period, you know, the period where they had the big pyramids and they were like, you know, they do the dance and they're just like... Like this, guys. We're gonna be supporting in some ancient Egyptians and some mummies in today's video and see whether we are able to take them out. Now, if you guys are excited, you wanna wish me some luck, make sure to be awesome. Like, if you're not awesome, well, sure, I understand. But, you know, if you are awesome, you would go down right now, smash that like button, guys. We're gonna go ahead and try and reach, ah, uh, let me think, let me think, 1,000 likes as usual, guys. And if you are new to the channel, welcome. I'm probably seeming a little overhyped right now, so I'm sorry, but... Make sure to hit the subscribe button and the little bell icon, ring, ling, ding, ding, to never miss an upload, guys. You know what? I'd really be thankful for that. Anyway, so let's get into today's video. Oop, no, nope, that is the pause menu. Yep, there we go. I, I've been playing Minecraft for like six years, and I still, I always accidentally hit the pause menu instead of the, the, the turning on the HUD. I'm doing well, guys. I'm doing well. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So as you see here, guys, we have a village. We have a normal village, but look at that, guys. This village is special because there is a desert temple in the middle and that is going to allow us this is a very special village guys this is an ancient egyptian village we're gonna go ahead check it out guys have a look at this all right all right we're coming up to the ancient egyptian village guys now we're not exactly welcome here because we aren't exactly ancient egyptians oh my gosh oh what in the world is this guys check it out we have an ancient egyptian just an ancient Egyptian, not a mummy, but just an ancient Egyptian villager here, guys. Look at him. He's, I've never thought I'd see a, a topless villager. Look at him. He's shirtless. You're looking very... You're, you ready for a swim, my dude? You, re <laughs> you ready for a swim? Look at him. He's got a nice little cloth so that we're not completely, like, scarred for life, guys. But that is what a shirtless villager looks like. And uh, these are the ancient Egyptian villages that inhabit this ancient Egyptian village, which... That makes sense, I think. I hope so. Anyway, so let's have a look at some of these other villages, guys. So here we go. Ooh, this one looks like he's the pharaoh. Fa pharaoh? Pharaoh. Far pharaoh. King. Pharaoh? I think it's the pharaoh, guys. I'm not 100% sure, but check this villager out, guys. He's really, really special. He's got the gold bracelets, the gold armbands. He's got a gold headband. Look at those purple eyes. He's got some blue eyeshadow. Some. R he's got a serious monobrow right there. This guy actually gets a full outfit, pretty much. He gets, like, this thing that goes around his neck. Uh, I think it means that he's, like, a king or something. I'm not really sure. I, I never lived in ancient Egypt, guys. And also, there's a cloth around uh, this one. He gets a white cloth, this guy, because he's just a little bit special. Um, let's see. Are there any other types of ancient Egyptian villagers in this village? Here we go. Uh, just a regular um, Egyptian village down here, back with the normal cloth around his waist. And those seem to be the main type of uh, villagers that inhabit this village. Let's check out the temple. We'll see whether there's anyone hiding in here. No, honestly, I don't see any other types of villagers at the moment. We'll just kind of have a little sneaky peek around here. Let's come down here. All right, yep. Just a few more normal villagers. So as you can see, guys, this is our ancient Egyptian village, which a bunch, a bunch, a bunch... English is a good language. I'm struggling so hard right now, guys. I took a week off recording videos, and now I just can't... Blah, English. Anyway, guys, so those are the main types of ancient Egyptians, but... Occasionally, you'll find a few extra rare ones, including mummies inside these temples. Now, we're going to go ahead and spawn them in ourselves so you don't have to go find them. And to do that, we're going to have to jump to the... Prepare for yourself. Creative inventory, guys. <laughs> All right, so we're jumping over here. Now, to do this, guys, you are going to need an add-on, so I'll have the download link in the description below. Go hit that if you want to spawn in some ancient Egyptian mummies without having to look for them, guys. So let's go ahead, jump over here. We're going to need to find the spawn eggs. Oh, where are the spawn eggs? I thought they were in here. All right, um, spawn eggs. Where are they? All right, I seem like an utter noob right now. They're probably, like, right in front of my eyes, and I'm just not looking very well. Please, where are the spot at? Oh, there they are. No wonder. All right, so here we go, guys. As you can see, we have a bunch of different Egyptian uh, mobs. So we've got the Egyptian warrior, the Egyptian underworld warrior, the Egyptian... 
Is that another Egyptian warrior? All right, we've got two types of Egyptian warriors here, guys. We've got the evil Egyptian warrior, the Axeman, the mummy. Ooh, the mummy. All right, and we also have the Egyptian guard, the Egyptian pharaoh, which I think we already saw earlier. And we have the ancient Egyptians. So here we go, guys. We've got a bunch of different Egyptians for us to spawn in. So let's go ahead and get started. So we've got the ancient Egyptian warrior. Now this guy is kind of... Yeah, he's a wearing much. He isn't exactly wearing much. He's just wearing an undie here. Just wearing some undies. Um, and he's got this really cool spear as well. So this guy's going to be able to take out a few guys um, and protect you from some other people or attack you. I don't know. Is he hostile? Let's find out, actually. Let's go ahead switch into game mode survival. Are you hostile? Yeah, 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 guys. He Oh, wow. He does a lot of damage. We need to run. We need to run. Oh, wow. That guy does so much damage. All right. So, scrap that, guys. He, the Egyptian warriors are actually really good, and they do quite a lot of damage here, guys. So, we do have the Egyptian warriors, and they don't like you hitting them. Fair enough. Fair enough, guys. If you do hit someone, I guess they are going to attack you back. So, there is the Egyptian warrior. Next, we have the Underworld warrior. And now, this guy, he's, he's he kind of looks like our Egyptian warrior from earlier, but, uh... He's kind of got... Wait, is he attacking? Oh no! The Underworld Warrior basically is the same as our normal warrior, but instead of defending his fellow Egyptians, he will actually kill them. What a dog move, dude! You're such a dog! Why would you do that to your fellow Egyptians? I'm sorry, but I'm just gonna have to end your life, dude. You're such a dog! Look at him, though. He's got, like, these weird kind of, like, decorations on him or something. He's got red eyes. That... That's a dead giveaway that he is evil. We better, oh, we better take him out before he kills all these poor Egyptians. All right, dude, dude, where are you? Come back here. Sorry, man, but you're just gonna have to go. I'm sorry, but like, you can't go around killing Egyptians nowadays. You know, it's 2018, 2017. I don't know when this video is coming out. I rec I'm recording in 2017, but it is like two days away from New Year's Day. So, 2018, 2017, I don't know. Oh, Happy New Year's, by the way, guys. Anyway, so there is our uh, Underworld Warrior. Basically, the evil version of the Egyptian Warrior. We have another Egyptian Warrior, all right? That's the same as earlier. I'm just kind of curious where his nipples went. Like, I know... Pro well, I guess... I know. They're gone, so I don't have to get demonetized. Thank you. Whoever made this add-on is brilliant. Now I don't have to get demonetized, because, like, he's technically not naked. He's just wearing a full body suit. That's pink. That's, that's what we're gonna go with, guys. Alright, so besides for that, we also have the evil Egyptian warrior. Let's spawn him in. We're gonna keep him away from the other guys. So, he seems pretty much the same as the other Egyptians. But, uh, yeah. If you go ahead and spawn an evil and a non-evil one, they will fight you down to the death. Check it out, guys. Alright, which one is gonna win? I don't know which one is the evil one and which one's not. But clearly one of them won. Clearly one of them won. I think it was the evil one. I think, yeah, well, the evil one was like one hit away. This guy's a good one. He's a good one. And he's also, I think that's his victory dance. Woo, buddy. Yeah, that victory dance is really strange. I'm, all right, you have problems, dude. I'm gonna just head over here. Thank you very much. All right, so we got the evil Egyptian warrior. Now, our next one is the Egyptian axe man. Oh, wow. This guy is massive. Whoa. Look at him, though. He is so much bigger than our Egyptian warriors, but he's like, he's giant. And he also has, like, this tiny axe, which is really, really funny. Uh, is he bad? I don't know. Let's spawn in a good guy. Oh, maybe? I can't tell. Nah, he's definitely bad, guys. The Egyptian warriors do not like having him around there. All right, so, uh, poor axe, man. He's kind of getting a little abused by, like, the tiny little Egyptian warrior right there. We'll leave you guys to your business. All right, so our next one is the Egyptian mummy. Now, to get this one, we're going to need to jump inside the temple because that otherwise we might get cursed, and we don't want that. That would be bad. Really, really bad. So let's go ahead and jump down. Come on, let me through. Thank you. Much love. All right, let's go ahead and three, two, one. Oh my gosh, guys. It is an Egyptian mummy. This thing is absolutely huge. Look at its red eyes. No way, dude. Look at that. That is insane. The Egyptian mummy inside this temple. It doesn't move a whole lot. I can imagine why. We're gonna leave him in here for now. We might try and battle him later and see how much health that guy has, but I don't really want to be cursed. So we're just gonna leave him in there for now, and we might try and battle out uh, after I've gone through the rest of these. So our next one is the Egyptian guards. Now these guys can go ahead and protect the other villagers from, you know, evil Egyptian warriors. L look at them, look at them. Now this guy, uh, 
This guy's a little interesting for some reason. His spear is just floating. He's using the force. I'm pretty sure that's Star Wars. I don't think they had the force back in ancient, Egypt ancient Egyptian times. But he is a lot more powerful than your normal ancient Egyptian warriors because of this, you know, cool looking Egyptian armor right there. So that is our Egyptian guard. Our next one is the Egyptian pharaoh. Pharaoh? Pharaoh? I, I don't know how it's pronounced, guys. Let me know in the comments below. Anyway, so this one, uh, alright, so he's got like this headpiece, this yellow and purple headpiece. I guess that signifies that he is the Pharaoh of the ancient Egyptians. And uh, he's got this full white body suit here, which also you can tell is like a sign of rich, I guess, of the rich. And he's got like these, uh, he's got these golden bands, I think they're called. Bracelets, rings, I'm not sure, guys. But yeah, he's got those around him to make him look super ultra rich. And that's just our pharaoh, guys. And uh, the guards will spawn around him and protect this guy from being attacked by absolutely anyone. That is the important thing. This guy hopefully won't die, but you know, if we spawn a mu- No, we probably shouldn't spawn a mummy out here, because that could be really catastrophic for this village. Alright, and finally guys, we've just got, you know, the casual ancient Egyptians. These guys come in all different shapes and sizes. We've got the- these guys, which are the librarians, I believe. I did- I think I called them the pharaohs earlier, whoopsie daisies. We have the normal ones with just some undies there, <laughs> and we also have uh, the ones with the cloths around their waist. So I- I'm trying not to laugh too hard, <laughs> because they're all just in undies, and like, I know I'm really immature, I'm sorry guys but it is kind of funny, you have to admit. Alright, so there we go guys. I've shown you all the different types of ancient Egyptians, but now we're gonna try and 1v1 the ancient Egyptian mummy. So to do that guys, let's go ahead and grab some diamond armor, because I don't know what kind of damage an ancient Egyptian mummy can do. I'm kind of worried. Ooh, he even got a spear. One of the uh, mobs we must have killed must have given us a spear. Check it out guys. You can actually hold the spear yourself. That's really, really cool. And you can use it as a weapon, I'm assuming. Let's try this out. Hachaw! Get speared! Get speared! Alright, there we go. I don't know what happened with my voice just then. But yeah, so you can use the spear as a sword as well. That's really cool. I really like that. That's... That's nice. I like it. I like it. So the ancient Egyptians will drop spears, which you can use. Alright, and finally, I'll grab some golden apples. Alright, guys. I'm pretty kitted up. I'm feeling ready. Let's switch into uh, survival here. For some reason, I've got really low heart, so I'll just go ahead and eat an apple real quick here, guys. Let's go ahead. We're coming for you, ancient Egyptian... Nope. All right. Uh, I need to get out of this hole first, and then we will come for you. Um, please let me out. Please, game. Let me out. Oh, parkour. Yep. All right. Cool. Let's get up back up here, guys. All right. You ready to take on the ancient Egyptian mummy? Look at him. Look at him. Look at him in all his glory, guys. It is an ancient Egyptian mummy. Let's go, guys. We're jumping in. Come on. Hotcha. Hotcha. All right. He doesn't... Is he not hostile? Are you hostile? Hello, dude. Are you hostile? No way, guys. I think the ancient Egyptian mummy is actually friendly. Aww. Are you just lonely that you've been stuck in here for so long? You know, I don't think he's hostile, guys. He's actually just lonely because he's stuck inside this massive thing. Oh, it's okay, Mr. Egyptian Mummy. It's okay, you've been lonely for so long. Here, I'm gonna keep you some company. Look, we're gonna take a nice little uh, photo together. Here, let's take a photo, guys. I can post this to all my friends and family. We can be just like, woo, hang it out with ancient Egyptian Mummy, man. <laughs> anyway, yeah, it just looks like he's lonely, guys. He doesn't want to attack me. Aw, what a big cutie, what a big cutie. All right, so it, it actually seems like these guys aren't up to fight. Yeah, I, I'm hitting him and he's just like, nah, sauce, dude. I'm, not, I'm too chill. I'm too chill. He doesn't want to attack me. That actually really surprises me. So you know what? If that's going to be the case, let's go ahead and switch into creative again. We're going to spawn in a bunch of Axemen and uh, the evil uh, ancient Egyptian warriors. And we'll see whether we can 1v1 them. This guy's still doing his victory dance. Having fun there, mate. Having fun there, mate. You're doing good. You're doing good out here in the uh, desert. Well, this is more of the savannah biome, but uh, you're good there, mate. Um, Okay. I'll take that as a no. <laughs> Let's go ahead and grab some more ancient Egyptians. So here we go. Um, we gotta grab the Egyptian Axeman and the evil Egyptian warrior. And we'll spawn a bunch of these guys in. Alright, here we go. And there we go. Alright, so we spawn a bunch of bad guys in. Let's go ahead and see whether we... Oh, I switched into creative. We want to switch into survival, preferably. Alright, let's go. Here we go, guys. Alright, they're coming at us. They're coming at us. Here we go. Alright, let's uh, retreat just a little. Alright. 
Right, you guys may be ancient Egyptians and you might have had a lot more experience in fighting than I have. But guess what? I have a diamond sword and you're using like ancient spears. Like, what's up with that, guys? All right, so they don't do too much damage while we have the diamond armor. Ooh, we're taking a little bit of damage. Ooh, 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 ooh. We're gonna come around. All right, here we go. Flanking from the side. All right, flank, 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 guys. Ooh, we're taking a little more damage. All right, golden apple time. Golden apple. Let's gapple up. Let's gapple up. All right, here we go. We're gonna retreat just a little bit. All right, here we come. Oh, wow. These guys are doing way more damage than I thought. They're really hard to kill, and we're dead. Ah! I thought we could take that many on, but they were, like, way harder to kill than I had first uh, anticipated. Like, they had way more health than I thought they would. Let's just pick up this stuff. Like, if I go ahead and grab the diamond sword. So, clearly, clearly I was uh, overestimating our strength there, guys. But these guys actually have a lot more health than they would let on. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. This is insane. I'm gonna stop counting because we're using a diamond sword and he's not like he's still alive. What is going on? That is insane, guys. Like this guy could basically be invincible. Look at how much damage this guy actually takes. That is insane. Like, ancient Egyptians were buff, dude. Like, that took so many hits to take him out. That is absolutely insane. That is crazy. So, yeah, don't mess with ancient Egyptians, I think, is the lesson from today's video. You know what the moral of the video, the, the lesson of today's video is just don't mess with the ancient Egyptians, guys. Just keep to the modern times. Hope you enjoyed today's video, guys. If you did, make sure to go down below. Drop a like on today's video. That'd be much appreciated. And until next time, guys, you know what's coming for you. Here it comes. It's coming around. It's coming around. I'm coming around. I'm coming around. I'm about to say it. You know what I'm going to say it. I'm just keeping you on suspense. EY stream out, guys. Till then, EY stream. Oh, I said EY stream out. Bye. Free. I said it twice. Anyway, you're out. Bye.